Hello friend, in this session we are going to discuss about enhance online DDL capabilities in Oracle Database 12C. First, beginning with the Oracle Database 12C, you can use the online keyword to allow execution of the DML statement during the following DDL operation. That is the drop index, drop constraints, alter index unusable and the set unused column. So this announcement enables simpler application development, exceptionally for the application migration. So what is going to be happen whenever you are using this online keyword while you are doing this kind of activity. So on that, on that time application development is going properly, fine and the, mainly for the application migration. So there are no application disturbance for the schema maintenance operation. So that on that time your application is not going to under the maintenance because uh, all this thing is done online. So first thing that is your drop index. The drop index statement is used to remove the index or the domain index from the database. So drop index online is supported for the partitioning and the non-partitioning indexes. The first thing is that there is the online. Specify the online to indicate that the DML operation on the table or partitions are allowed while dropping the index. So whenever you are dropping the index, fine. So on that time you can define the online keyword. So on other hand, what are the DML operations are there on the table that is working fine. It is not going to be affected. Next thing that is the force keyword. So if you want to drop the domain index on that time you need to use the force keyword. Fine. Online is only required when you have a normal indexes, but force is required when you when you have the domain indexes. Next, drop constraint. So drop constraints online enables you to drop the integrity constraint from the database with some restrictions. So cannot drop the constraint with the cascade, cannot drop the reference integrity. Fine. So here if you want to drop the any of the constraint, how can you drop alter table employee table name drop constraint, this is the constraint name and this is the online. So in this way, you can also drop your constraint online. Next, index unusable. So what does it mean? Specifying the unusable keyword to mark the index or the index partition or the index of partition unusable. So this index is not going to be usable. So you are marking this index that is as a unusable. So this index is not going to be use whenever you are just selecting the data from the table. So the space allocation for the index or index partition or the sub partitions is free immediately when you mark the object unusable. So what are the spaces consumed by the, consumed by this index that is the that is going to be free immediately. The unusable index must be rebuilt or it must be dropped and recreated before it can be used. So if you want to use it again, what you need to do? You need to either rebuild it or you need to drop it and create it again. While the one partition is marked as a unusable, the other partitions of the index are still valid. If any other indexes you have or any other partitions of the indexes you have that is going to be work fine, that is not going to be affected. On Oracle Database 12C, alter index unusable close is made online by specifying the online keyword. Fine, so what you can do, alter index, index name. Uh, alter index unusable whatever the index name and make it as a online. So that is going to be indicated that the DML operation on the table of partitions are allowed while marking the index unusable. Fine. So here you can do this thing alter index whatever the index name unusable online. So this index is going to be unusable. Select status from user underscore index where table name equal to EMP. So you can just check the status of this index that is going to be unusable because you just make it as a unusable. But here the DML operations are allowed whenever you are making this index unusable. Next set the unused column. So set the unused column can be the first step to free the space in the database by dropping the columns no longer needed. So whenever you just make the set unused column of uh, so that is the first step to free the space from the database by dropping the columns no longer needed. Fine. So whatever the columns you don't require in the future at this moment you can just make it as a unused. 
the online keyword indicates that the dml operations on the table are allowed while ma marking the column unused so whenever you are marking this column as a unused on that time whatever the dml operations are there that is not going to be affected and these things you are doing online the create table table name we are just creating the one table insert into some values select star from emp and now what you can do alter table emp set unused e name online so what is going to be happen here whenever you are doing this activity fine on that time any dml operations are going on on this table that is not going to be affected because you are doing this activity online and after that you can just check the dsc emp fine so in this session we have discussed about the enhanced ddl capa uh, capability so let's see all these things practically so let's see enhanced online ddl capabilities so first of all you can drop the index online so here if you want to drop the any index online how can you drop just here issue the command drop index t1 idx1 online force so here we not require the force so i am just removing this thing and just drop the index in this way so i am just connecting to the sys cdb1 at pdb3 fine you can just drop the index so index is dropped this is online so you can just perform this task online so that is not going to be affect the any of your dml operation the same way you can just make the index as a unusable so this is you are just making the index that is unusable this index is we already have so this is the online unusable which is not required so if you want this index again you need to rebuild it again next unused column so if you want to make any of the column unused at this moment so you can also do so create table emp emp name where to id number so what i am doing creating the table fine very easy insert into emp values i am just inserting the values then select star from emp team 4 alter table emp set a new e name online so here cannot drop column from the table yeah this is because of connected with the sys user so what i need to do uh, i need to just create the table with the any of the any other user so what i will do local user pdb3 i will just connect and pdb3 so i am going to perform this task create table emp e name worker to 20 id number find table is created insert into value emp now just alter table emp set a new enum online so table is altered so now if you are checking this thing select star from emp you can see only one column so the second column is now unused fine so in this way all this activity you can perform online that means the dml operation is, that is not going to be affected so your dml operation is not going to be affected so this is the enhanced online ddl capability in oracle database 12c thank you